If you want a warm, sweet holiday drink, but you're tired of hot chocolate and it's too late in the day for caffeine, I present to you hot vanilla. I debated whether I should even make a video for this, since it's barely a recipe and it's ridiculously easy to make, but this drink has become a cold weather staple in our home, so I thought I'd share it on this easy, gentle cooking series. Here's what you'll need. Milk, a mug, sugar, vanilla extract, a spoon, and a microwave. There are also a number of optional ingredients which we'll get into later, but this is the basic setup. First, fill your mug with milk, any milk you like, and I leave at least one inch exposed at the top to prevent spillage. Then gently heat this milk in the microwave. It's important to use a lower setting on your microwave. I like to cook mine at a four or a five out of 10. Cook time will vary depending on your microwave and the size of your mug, but with my model and with this mug, I find that about five minutes at half power is just about right. Just to be on the safe side, I recommend microwaving your milk for one minute at a time and stirring it in between. The best way to know if your milk is hot enough for you is by taking a little sip from the spoon. Once it's to your desired hotness, add a spoonful of sugar and a spoonful of vanilla. Give it a good stir, and there you go, hot vanilla. Since it's the holidays and since I'm extra fancy, I like to grate some fresh nutmeg onto mine. It makes it taste like eggnog, minus the eggs and the booze. Speaking of booze, as I mentioned earlier in the video, there are a number of ways you can customize your hot vanilla. You can spike it with a milk-friendly liqueur like Bailey's, Creme de Cacao, or Kahlua. Or instead of vanilla extract, you could add all sorts of extracts. I happen to have hazelnut, almond, and coconut extracts here, but you could also use peppermint, maple, or any other extract you think might be good. And speaking of maple, you can also play with different sweeteners. Honey is classic with milk, but maple syrup or brown sugar also add a nice depth of flavor. There's also flavored syrups like these, hazelnut, caramel, and vanilla. Hot vanilla is a tasty way to keep warm in these cold months, and it's ridiculously easy to make, so I hope you give it a try. Special thanks to Britt, Honey Badgers, Megan M, Matthew, Jenny D, Robert Z, Jocelyn, Gina F, Megan B, Data Fox, Gina S, Ruth, Katie, Lonesome Screams, Mihir, Morgan, Vitfafo, Britta, Veda, and Colette. 